Today, I am going to be winning a game with the last team to win every single championship in the four major sports. Baseball in the World Series Championship, Basketball in the NBA Finals, Hockey and the Stanley Cup, and Football and the Super Bowl Championship. And we are going to start things off with the new Stanley Cup champions. Just won it last night, recording this video the next day. You guys are seeing it, hopefully, on the next day. After the Colorado Avalanche win themselves a Stanley Cup and take down the Tampa Bay Lightning. Stop that 3 P from happening, which a lot of people thought could happen, but the Avs played great. They win it in Tampa Bay. We got McKinnon. We got McCarr. We got Landeskog. We got Ranton. And this team was so good. They were my favorite going in to the Stanley Cup playoffs. And they finally pick up that title. And now we got to win it with them in the NHL video game as well. Then we're going to basketball and working on the Warriors. We had a lot of good chances already to start this game off against the Hurricanes. So if you're an Avs fan, I'm sure you're happy about the Stanley Cup final win. And now we're going to celebrate with an NHL 22 win. Here comes the shoe skin. He had a really good final as well. We have Landeskog skating in misses the one-timer try to go glove side there couldn't get it to go landis got trying to keep this one in can't do it oh we got the top line out there let's get some open space mckinnon you know mckinnon can fly you know mckinnon can fly look at that strong on the puck couldn't get it past freddie anderson not my best move but i didn't have much ice to work with there but mckinnon he's got that speed trying to get back in there with him exactly what we're going to do. McKinnon, so good on the puck. McKinnon to Rantanen. What are you looking at, Rantanen? We had, a, we had some open ice right there. I don't know what he was doing. McKinnon, move in front. Oh, what a shot. Did he get tripped? Is that a penalty? They're not going to call it a penalty. McKinnon slap. Oh, they are going to call it. We are going to get a power play. We're looking for that first goal. We're throwing the top power play unit out there. We got McCarr. Conn Smythe, winner. He's going to shoot to Kadri. The rebound. And we get one right off the draw on the power play. McCarr. Conn Smythe, winner. Puts it on net. Kadri buries in. It's 1-0 out. See if we can get another one before the end of the period. We've been the better player so far. We got the second line. We got the captain. We got Landis Gog. Skated first with the Stanley Cup. Obviously, as every captain of every NHL team does. Hits in the shoe skin right there, Kale McCarr. Not like I drew it up. Hit Jarvis. Big hit. Oh, he's got two on one. Aho, got to be careful. Taze, big poke. Big poke by Devon Taze. Oh, the shoe skin. We're going to have a breakaway. He's got some speed. Strong on the puck as well. Nothing there. Try to get that one to Landis. He went to Kadri. That actually isn't where I want to put it. We got chance made for one more shot. Kadri save Freddy. Can we get a goal for McKinnon or Rantanen? We have one for Kadri. Can we get McCarr, McKinnon, or Rantanen on the board? Landeskog as well. One of those guys I'd like to score a goal with. Especially McKinnon or Landeskog or Rantanen. McCarr has an assist already. Oh, big poke by McCarr to start the second period. Huge poke. Get that one to Rantanen. We have a two-on-one. McKinnon, you're going to skate to the front of the net, and he does. Nathan McKinnon make it snappy. The X Factor, we put that in the back of the net. 2 nothing Avalanche. He's going to take a penalty. We're going to have a power play at the minimum, but we might have a goal. Landeskog, good moves by Landeskog. Great moves by Gabriel Landeskog. That's a big save. Kadri has the goal in the power play. Oh, we have McCarr to 2 one saving it, keeping it with Kadri. He's blocking the pass. Couldn't get that pass over to McCarr, even though I wanted it. Let's get this one to the point. McKinnon will keep it. Landeskog, good move again. Landeskog's due for a goal. Ranton and keeps that one. He has an assist. Is he going to get two? I don't know if Kadri got saved by Anderson or if he hit the side of the net, but we're getting a five on three. All right, we got a minute left of this power play. He killed the five on three. Didn't even really get possession. There's Landeskog, though. Wait. Send it to McKinnon. He's coming in. McKinnon slap shot. Saved by the pads of Anderson. Big shot there. Keeps it in. Oh, not quite. Landeskog, he doesn't have a goal yet. Skate across. Now he does. Gabriel Landeskog, there we go, and peace out, that's game. Now we got the Golden State Warriors, and we are in Golden State, and we have Russell Westbrook on us, and green life for Steph Curry, the NBA final champions for the fourth time, Steph Curry, Draymond Clay, okay good, he's not quitting, we're in the game, there's Westbrook, put a big defensive play by Draymond, and even Steph right there, to keep that one off the board, can we shoot with Andrew Wiggins? Oh, it's going to go in and out right there. But the Warriors, their fourth title in the last eight years. They've gone to like six straight finals, I want to say, with Steph, Clay, and Dre all healthy. Oh, there's LeBron, though. Yep, that's LeBron M1. That's ridiculous. Oh, that's good defense. No way. Anthony Davis right there, but Steph gets the board. Oh, that's terrible by me. Pick it up. When they, like, get stolen from in this game, they have no idea what they're doing, some of these players. It makes no sense. All right, we got 80 on Steph. We have to expose the mismatch. He's behind me. Shoot it. Green, Steph. Iguodala on the court. He has four championships, too. Oh, that's just... Oh, my God, Iguodala. That's just timing by me right there. Are you leaving Steph open? Bang! 
Can't leave Steph open. Thank you for the three. Big steal by Steph. I'll give it to Steph. He's got to make this, right? Wide open. What a steal by Steph. Pass him out. Pass him out. Oh, yeah. That's going to go in every time. Possibly get the last shot here. Steph. Oh, my God. Bang. Steph Curry at the buzzer. We're just about green light moving shot. That's ridiculous. Here we can do with Gary Payton. The Bielishka. Oh, he'll throw that one down. Oh, good move. Oh, he made me jump. He had me everywhere. But there's the defense. Too many moves. Sometimes I hate the animations. It works out for people and it doesn't work out from time to time. That was a stupid animation they gave him. Easily should have scored right there. I don't know what's going on there. Corner. All was wide. We take the mid-range instead. And it goes. Don't always have to take three. Sometimes you can take twos. Don't always have to take threes. That is great defense. What a move. Great defense. I'd like to hit a three with uh, Clay. He's wide open. Clay, come on. Oh, but he quit. Doesn't even matter. GG. Now we have the Super Bowl champion, Los Angeles Rams. That feature the best player in the NFL, in my opinion, Aaron Donald. Now, I'm going to be using this game for two different videos. The video you're watching right now, for the most part, if you're watching the first of the two videos, is going to be the championship video, winning a game with every single championship team. That is the Rams, but a video I'm doing in two days is going to consist of winning a game with the best player in every sport, and that is going to feature this game as well with Aaron Donald and the Los Angeles Rams. We're going to have some other great players in the other sports. We have the NHL. We have the MLB, we have the NBA, but you guys are first seeing this with the championship video. So for the championship video, we have the Rams, we have the Warriors, we obviously have the new Avalanche, Stanley Cup champions, and the Braves from last year, and we're going to be rolling with the Rams in this video, who beat the Cincinnati Bengals in the Super Bowl. As for the Aaron Donald aspect, the best player in the NFL, you can make the argument for Tom Brady, Patrick Mahomes, Josh Allen, Aaron Rodgers, a lot of great quarterback options, but the guy that dominates on the defensive side of the ball, and is no question the best defensive player in the NFL right now is Aaron Donald. So that's why I went with Donald. I feel like the gap between the next best defensive player and Aaron Donald is just way bigger than it is for the quarterbacks. And I figure because I'm going to be doing both of these videos in the next two days, why make two different games for the Rams when I could just do one and get a great win? You guys see it twice. It is going to be a great game because we are going to take out the Raiders in this one. The Rams had a heck of a season going back to that Super Bowl. I didn't expect them to get out of the NFC. I expected it was going to be the Buccaneers. I expected that it could possibly be the Green Bay Packers, but it is the Los Angeles Rams, and Robert Woods no longer a Ram, but he's going to get in the end zone and get us started. But now it's time to watch Aaron Donald dominate. I want to see a ton of sacks on Derek Carr, and I'm actually going to do something I never do. I am going to use her the line. I am going to use her Aaron Donald and see what we can do with his X Factor. I am going to do this. I don't know why I'm going to do this, but we are going to try. Aaron Donald just trucked that guy, but unfortunately, the play was on the other side of the field, so I had no chance at a tackle. That is what's going to be unfortunate. If the play is on the other side of the field, I I'm going to have no chance of making a play with Donald. Von Miller actually makes the tackle there. Me and Von Miller also fell down, but somehow Von made the tackle. You guys might have to give me a little bit of a break, though. I've never used the defensive line. So if I absolutely stink, please do not yell at me in the comments. As Deshaun Jackson almost had a touchdown. Come on, Donald, make a play. He's not going to run towards Aaron Donald. I'm going to have no chance at a play. He's going to have to pass. He goes up the middle. Von Miller can't tackle him in time. I think that's the enemy user in the defensive line. I'm embarrassing Aaron Donald by doing that. But there's Cooper Cup. What kind of a pass is this, Matthew? We're lucky that wasn't picked. Cooper Cup could have been more wide open over the middle. What was that pass by Matthew Stafford? So no more usering Aaron Donald. We're going to let him do his own thing. He'll make better plays like that. Trust me. I'm going to have to throw this. Oh, my God. He left it for a second. I'm lucky. I had to throw it. I had nothing else open. Robert Woods lays out and makes a play. We haven't been able to get the ball so far to Cooper Cup. See if we can change that. Does he have hot routes everywhere? He doesn't. I don't know why. He should be able to hot route anywhere he wants. I'll get rid of the Stafford. Oh, that's grounding. Come on. Let's block for Matthew Stafford, maybe. Oh, that's a great pass over the middle. That's a great route by Higby. There you go. Same thing. Maybe get a little more aggressive, depending on what we have here. I'm going to try Cooper Cup. This could be an absolute dot. What a catch by Cooper Cup. What a throw by Stafford. That really is an insane catch by Cooper Cup. That's a ridiculous catch. And there's an easy catch for Cooper Cup. Look at the man go. Cooper Cup, he's disgusting. Same play. We got two reads here. Akers out of the backfield or Cup across the middle. And we go to Cup across the middle. Can he get in? He can't. I got to run this once inside the goal line here. Never mind. Never should have did that. Hustle back. 
Can we make a play? Two minute warning. I guess running it was a stupid idea. Now we're throwing it on fourth down. We're going for the touchdown. It's Cooper Cup. Who else in the red zone? Who else but Cooper Cup for the touchdown? So no more user in the defensive line. We're going to let Aaron Donald go to work just like he can by himself. Because I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, but there's a pick six. <laughs> One play not used in the defensive line, and we're on the board defensively. Totally off the do here. Watch him, Waller. That's the read. Running back. Watch Jacobs. Oh, my God. He ran me over. That's a big hit stick. Donald, make a play. Weddle. Oh, I thought he was going to throw it through the middle right there. Good pass to Zay Jones. All right. We just can't stop this run to the outside of Kenyon Drake like at all. He's definitely going to do it again. He's got 53 seconds. He has time. Oh, this is that uh, RPO. He can either run it. We're, oh, there's Donald. Oh, wait, no, it's Von Miller making a play. We'll take it, though. Go, Jalen. You got to guard Darren Waller. Oh, 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 I'm an idiot. What am I doing? He passed it right to me. I literally went to go guard actually the open guy and he threw it right to me. We got one play for field goal range, but I'm looking for Cooper Cup. I'm looking for Cooper Cup. Cooper Cup. Oh, he's down at the 40, but hey, that's field goal range. I thought he was going to get loose for a touchdown. To make this a two possession game again indoors. Oh, I got it. Should be a two-possession game, and it will be at the end of the half. Huge catch by Cup. Give Donald some time. Let him get there. Let him get there. Come on, Donald. Make a play defensively. Let's see what you got on third and 12. A sack here to basically end the game. We stop him here. This game's basically over. Oh, what a play. What a pass. I did not see that. That's fine. That's fine. We'll get a stop. We'll get a stop. Oh, he threw a bad ball. Jalen Ramsey. Thank you very much. That's Aaron Donald getting pressure. I don't even know if he did, but you know what? I'm going to count as he did. Maybe Cup on a crossing route. We got Akers as well. Oh, we got Cup. We got Cup. We got Cup. Cooper Cup to Stafford. There's nobody else you need to throw it to. We're looking like the real life Rams right now. I think it's safe to say right here that this is the game. We got to stop. This one's over. Let's go get him. He's going to try to run it. He's going to try to run it. Did he get that? He did not. I think that's game. 17 points. And we have ball. I think it's over. Now we switch it up. We throw a cup on the streak. Woods on the corner. Inside ball. What a pass by Stafford. What a catch by Cup. And this is the final play from scrimmage for the NFL. And Aaron Donald will snap the ball. We'll pick up the first down with Sony Michelle. We'll run into our own teammates. And we'll win it by 18. And now we get to finish things off with the World Series champions from last year, the Atlanta Braves. Now, the MLB season is going on right now, but the Braves are the last team to win the championship, the last team to win the World Series. So they're going to be in this video. And sadly, there is no Freddie Freeman. I don't know if you Braves fans are happy about that. If you're upset about that, you have Matt Olson now. But he was there for the championship team. But in MLB The Show 22, he is not on the team, so I can't use him. I was debating going back to MLB The Show 21 and doing it. But I wasn't sure if I could find a game. It wasn't the newest game, so I didn't know. So I stayed with 22. But if you're a Braves fan, I'm sure you're happy about everything Freddie Freeman did for you. So... You're not mad about anything. Freddie Freeman helped you guys win a World Series, so you can't be mad at him. But now let's focus our attention to this game. We got Blue Jays Braves. Oh, and that's smacked. That's a really good swing with the Oscar. Orton started off really good. Two pitches or two outs or something like that. Wow, we're going to give up a hit. And we're going to give up a run. He's not going to go. He had that easy. He had that easily. I'm struggling to find a pitch to throw this guy. He's pretty solid at the plate. Thank God we get out of here. Bases loaded. We had two outs. Nobody on. Then he got three straight people on. Let's hit, though. I've never been the biggest fan of Acuna swinging game. But today, I guess I am. Because Ronald Acuna Jr., first pitch he sees, it is out of here. Ronald Acuna Jr., he didn't get to play in the World Series because he was injured. But he still got a ring. He's still a World Series champion. And now he's got a home run in this game. Look at that one off the bat. I was a little bit early on that one too, but he smacked it. 409, 108 off the bat. The last time I faced Kevin Gaussman, we absolutely owned him. I think it was the Pirates I was using. We absolutely destroyed Kevin Gaussman with the Pirates. So the Braves have a better lineup. I expect to do the same thing. We have a 3-2 count to Austin Riley. Matt Olsen's up next. It's got to be good. It's good. Opposite field. That's going to be a double at least for Austin Riley. I'm going to say that's two. Definitely going to be two. We got Olsen up next. Let's see what he can do as a replacement for Freddy. Oh, I missed that horribly. I guess it wasn't terrible, but man, I had a chance to absolutely destroy that baseball and make this a 3-0 game. Brought the PCI just down a little too much. But Darno going to send that one opposite field. I'm running on him. I'm running on him. He hesitated. I don't know what he's doing. And Austin Riley's in there. That'll make it a 2-0 game. 
Ozuna, he'll ground out, so we get two. I wasn't a huge fan of my pitching performance in the first inning, so that insurance run is going to be huge. This game's early, though. There's a strikeout. Uriel, 3-1 count. Good pitch. I thought that one could get out, honestly. This could be a really good pitch or a really bad pitch. Curveball, just going to get the side of the zone. Hung a little bit, but Olsen... Right to him. And he quit in the second inning. I'll take it. GG. That is going to do it for winning a game with every single championship team in the major four sports. Let me know what city, what challenge do you want to see next? Peace.